What's going on, sports cars fans? Ray from Philly here. It's Saturday night, July 15th. And I want to show a card that I picked up. I've been doing a run for a local Philadelphia legend, basically, named Bobby Shantz, who used to play for the Philadelphia Athletics. Not the Oakland Athletics, not the Kansas City Athletics, the Philadelphia Athletics. So this is a, a gentleman that is uh, this September going to hit 98 years old. And played under Connie Mack at one point. So this is, uh, if you have a chance to meet someone like that that's been in the league from the early 50s and played for a legend like Connie Mack, why wouldn't you want to go and meet him? So I've been doing his run of all his cars to get autographed because he's around here quite frequently. I started this project about four years ago and he has 17 total base cards. Uh, five of them are Bowman and uh, 12 are Tops. So I only needed one more card to have him sign, and that was this, his 53 tops. His rookie is 50 Bowman, so he has from 50 to 55, and then um, he has 52 tops up to, I think, 64. So he's got 17 cards total. I had 16 of the 17 signed, and he was in, an, in my area a few days ago on Tuesday night. And I went over, and was uh, my local card shop was doing a, a video podcast with uh, Bobby Shantz on, and at the end of the podcast, he was signing autographs. Also, there was former Philly um, shortstop from the 60s named Bobby Wine. He also was the assistant coach on the 1980 uh, world champion Phillies team. Dallas Green was the manager, and Bobby Wine was the assistant manager. So Bobby Wine has been a part of the Phillies organization for over 60 years. He was there also. Uh, I watched the podcast. I went up to Mr. Shantz, and I had him sign this. 1953 tops it's his most expensive card even though it's not his rookie uh, because it's a high number uh it's a short print very short print card and it took me a while to find this card i finally came and uh, found it at a decent reasonable price and uh, actually i got this from my lcs store uh, last monday and went tuesday night to hang out watch the podcast and have mr Shantz sign it so I'm going to get take send all these cards to uh, PSA DNA to get them slabbed just for uh, prevention and keeping them in good shape. Plus, they'll look good in slabs. And so uh, from what I was told, uh, I was looking around for if any YouTubers out there that did PSA bulk, PSA DNA bulk submissions. And I was told that Garrett Cardcutter does it. Uh, I think it's called Slab City. So Garrett, if you're out there, uh, I'm going to... Uh, look you up and we're going to talk to just to see how much it costs. I have 17 cards that I like to submit of all Bobby Shantz cards, get them slabbed and just authenticate it. I'm not, I don't care about the grade of the card. I uh, just want to, and I don't care about the grade of the autograph. I just want to authenticate it and, and preserved uh, in a nice slab. So uh, there you have it. I just wanted to come on and finally show that I'm finished the Bobby Shantz run and uh, all 17 cards are going to be going out to PSA DNA to get preserved, authenticated, and slapped. Uh, so at the end of this video, I went up. Uh, you're going to see a video of me meeting Bobby Shantz and having him sign this. This is in the last two times I've asked him the same question about what he thinks about the pitch count. And his uh, response is priceless. Uh, the, last year at Carl's Cards, I asked him that and he said it was a bunch of bulk, you know what? Didn't really like the pitch count. He's an old school guy. So I asked him the same question again this time. And uh, he, he was a little bit more calmer this time. He just said that it was taking away from the game. And Bobby Wine was sitting right next to him. Uh, he went off a little bit. He was like, uh, the, the pitchers years ago, you had to fight to take the ball away from them. So enjoy this little video clip at the end. It's only like 30 seconds, uh, meaning Bobby Shantz. Great guy, legendary player in the history of Philadelphia baseball. Finished it up, 53 tops, Bobby Shantz. Until then, like I always say, have fun with it. See you real soon. Hey, Bobby. How you doing? Nice to meet you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
Quick question, what do you think of the pitch count today? The <laughs> pitch count? Yeah, they get under 100 pitches. <laughs> Pitchers back then would have fought you. Yep. Trying to get, you have to fight them to get the ball out of their hands. Yep. Thank you, Bobby. Thank you. Thank you, sir.